must you scream every time it thunders? Did you know that thunder is only air rapidly expanding? I know, Angie. Kent, what is that thing you're pounding on so loudly? It's my Moomba, a robot that is charged by moonlight. It makes cute little beeping noises. Did you know that moonlight is really just sunlight reflected off the moon? I know, Angie. Time for a test run, little guy. Make me proud. Kent, your moon thingy is attacking me. But it's cute the way it beeps, right? I sure hope the rain stops soon. Being stuck in the secret lab all week hasn't been good for anybody. Does it smell like bacon? Did you know that? Bacon smells good because of the Maillard reaction, which causes sugars to react with amino acids. Angie, you're in information overload. We've got to get outside, all of us. We're starting to lose it. Aren't you being a tad melodramatic? That means overreacting. We know, Angie. Angie. Okay, okay. Von Bolt, please call up Mr. Edison. What's the problem, my young geniuses? When will the rain stop? Maybe it's not a question of when, but a question of how. Great suggestion, Mr. Edison. Let's come up with a way to stop the rain. It rains when water droplets in a cloud become big enough for gravity to pull them down, much like an apple falls from a tree. What if we shot a laser at the clouds to break the bigger water droplets into smaller ones not affected by gravity? We should be able to stop the downpour. That should do it. You okay, Nikki? I'm okay. Let's go see if it worked. Ah, sunshine! I'm already in a better mood. Ow, ow! Ow, 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 ow! Weird. There's my sunshine! <laughs> Where is it? <laughs> oh, lab rats. I really thought the laser would work. No need to get upset about it. Yeah, we'll just try something else. Ugh! Weird. I am not happy, people! Ouch! 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 What was that for? Checking a theory. I'm not in the best of moods, you know. I see a monkey shape in the clouds. It's a storm caused by Nikki. How is that even possible? I saw the laser beam travel through the Kaflugulator before hitting Nikki. The Kaflui changed the beam so that now Nikki's emotions are controlling the weather. Ouch, Kent! Ouch! Your Boomba is at it again! Arrgh! Not Boomba, Moonba. You just need to relax. If you don't stop it, I will! Whoa! Angie, you're right. We've got.
got to get Nikki to lighten up. What if we make her laugh? Yes, that's it! I am not amused! Okay, what were you saying? We need to neutralize Nikki's emotions. Maybe if we expose a calm person to the beam, their emotions will cancel out Nikki's. Great, but where are we going to find somebody who's totally calm? Kent! Kent! So, we need a plan for getting him into that beam. Or... Sorry, clumsy me. I understand perfectly. Okay, so there is the Kent storm, and that's the Nikki storm. Wait, so now there are two storms? Kent's emotions didn't neutralize the Nikki storm. We've got to stop the storm before it gets any worse. A proper scientist researches first, then executes. But where do we even start? I think a visit to an expert on powerful storms is in order. JD, stay here and keep Nikki calm. Sure, give me the easy job. So, who's up for a game of DNA shoots and strands? Hi, I am Theodore Fujita. Come spin with me. Any particular reason why you're doing this? I have invented a way to measure a storm that has spinning as one of its major components. The Fujita, or F scale, invented by me, classifies tornado intensity based on damage. This wind is moving at a fast speed, and this wind is moving at a slower speed. This causes the air between them to rotate around in a barrel shape. But if there is an updraft or rising wind, the barrel shape will tilt vertically. And a tornado is formed. <gasps> Nikki and Kent. So two different winds at different speeds can form a tornado? Unless you get those winds to be at the same speed. Thanks, Mr. Fujita. Perhaps you should check the rule book. Everyone listen up! Nikki and Kent, you are controlling the weather with your emotions! What? The laser we built gave you the power to control the weather! Nice! That is ridiculous! Or maybe not. Nikki, if you don't calm down, you and Ken could cause a tornado! Okay, okay! <sighs> you guys gotta keep me calm. Kent, foot rub. Von Bolta JD, cookies. Relaxing thoughts, Nikki. Hey, instead of calming Nikki down, what if we make Kent mad? It's worth a try. Kent, doesn't it bother you when someone else's mess spills into your lap space? Well, yes, sometimes. Your socks don't match. Leg hair phobia isn't real. Mega Blast Man is a loser! <gasps> he is not a loser! Is too! Is not! He's a He's a super duper hero! <gasps> Von Bolt! Are you okay? I am undamaged. In fact, just call me Sparky. Phew. 
<laughs> Kent, I'm sorry. And your Moonbot isn't the most annoying invention ever. I'm sorry, too. I shouldn't have gotten so mad. And I think Mega Blast Man is a pretty cool superhero. Think our weather powers are gone? The effects should be temporary. Now that's funny! <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Wish I could make the rain stop. Sizzly slop, drizzly pop. Wish I could make the rain stop. Trippity drop, flippity flop. Wish I could make the rain stop. Sizzly slop, drizzly pop. Wish I could make the rain stop. The old man snores when it rains and pours. Close the windows and lock the doors. There's no Wish I could make the rain stop. Sizzly slop, drizzly pop. Wish I could make the rain stop. Trippity drop, flippity flop. Wish I could make the rain stop. Sizzly slop, drizzly pop. Wish I could make the rain stop. We'll be at home when the lightning strikes. All alone, it's so frightening. Yikes! By myself and a friend. Wish I could make the rain stop. Sizzly slop, drizzly pop. Wish I could make the rain stop. For more fun videos, subscribe to Cartoon Channel.